Israeli troops say they've arrested more than 100 terror suspects after a raid at one of Gaza's largest hospitals. Israel claims troops found medication with the names of hostages during the raid, but none of the 130 Israeli hostages were found. Meanwhile, Israel is pressing ahead as its allies urge restraint in Rafah. Holly Williams is in Ramallah in Israeli-occupied West Bank. Good morning. Israel's defense minister said yesterday that the country's military is, quote, thoroughly planning for operations in Rafa in southern Gaza. That's after President Biden reiterated a warning to Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu against launching an offensive in Rafa without a credible plan to protect civilians. Around one and a half million Palestinians are sheltering in Rafa. But as Israel pushes ahead with plans for a ground offensive in the city, the US is planning for what comes after the Israel-Hamas war, including a separate state for the Palestinians in the West Bank and the Gaza Strip. Shalom, salam, peace. A so-called two-state solution has long been US policy, with hopes it'll end the cycle of violence. But I think the only ultimate answer here is a two-state solution that's real. I pity him. Does he, does he really think that this idea has the tiniest chance in the world? No chance. Daniela Weiss is a leader among religious, far-right-wing Israeli settlers. Instead of a Palestinian state, she and others are planning to move to Gaza. And Weiss told us they'll pay Palestinians to leave. The Arabs made a hell Hell, literally hell with underground cells. They live there like rats. So disgusting for them. So just to be clear, you want only Jewish people to live in Gaza, only no Jewish. Palestinians. No Arabs in Gaza. Weiss currently lives in the West Bank, along with around half a million other Israeli settlers residing on occupied Palestinian territory. The settlements are regarded as illegal under international law. But several settlers are now in Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's cabinet, and some of them share Daniela Weiss's opinions. We know how to uh, manage such a big place as Gaza. We will make paradise out of it. The soldiers that come out of the battles, they will get, get plots of land. Arabs out, Jews in. Daniela Weiss and her allies do not represent mainstream opinion in Israel. But as we've seen here in the West Bank, they can have a powerful impact on Israeli politics. Prime Minister Netanyahu has said that Israel does not want to occupy or govern Gaza. For CBS Saturday Morning, Holly Williams, Ramallah.